All right, guys, this is David, and I'm in PE High. Um, I want to use this video to show you what the road route looks like in PEI just in case you want to do your road test. Now, this is not the actual road route for your road test in PEI, but this drive I'm, I'm about to do is going to let you know that what the road rules looks like in maybe like Mountain or Sackville or whatever it is that you have probably been to before is just like is the same when you are right here in PI. So I'll do a quick drive like 15 minutes drive just to show you what the route looks like and most likely when you are doing your road test the examiner might be taking you through this route if you are doing it right here in, Monk in PI. All right, so I'm gonna hit the road right now and I'll show you what this route, this road network looks like. Okay, the road, you know the drill, the, exa the examiner is gonna ask you um, to check your vehicle and to be sure that it's okay. And after that, then you're gonna hit the road. So I'm going to hit the road right now. Anyway, this is the building of Access PEI. So when you come for your road test in Piha, you start your um, your drive test from this point. Okay. All right. So let's go. Now I'm heading towards the main route. Signal left. I check my mirror. I check my side to the left, and I'm going through the main road. This is where your road test might start from. So I'm gonna go right now. I signal right, check my mirror, check my side to the right, and I'm joining the road. There we go. Okay. So my hand is on 10 and 2. When you're doing your road test, your hand should be always on 10 and 2. Don't do like this, don't do like this. It should be right here on 10 and 2. I'm going towards a roundabout and I'm going to take right. There's a yield sign there. I signal right. There is no car coming from my right. So I can go. There's a yield sign. If you see that kind of yield sign, you need to yield for a car if a car is coming that direction. Now that's a 40 limit that we are seeing right here. So my speed will be on 40. If you go above 40 here, the examiner is going to fail you. Okay. So I'm heading towards what looks like a traffic light. Now I'm going to take my left. So I signal left. Check my mirror. Check my side to the left. And I'm going towards the traffic light. It's on red. And when it's on red, you don't want to go. You don't want to beat the traffic light. My signal is on, the signal should always be on. All right, so it's green. I'm going down the road now. There's a traffic light again and it's red. Now I have to come to a stop on that red. And I'll wait for it till it goes back to green. Okay, it's green for me now, then I can go. Okay, so there we go. So I'm going straight. taking the right turn. I have no stop sign so I'll just go slowly and nicely into this pathway. You don't have to stop at that spot because you have no stop sign. And I'm going straight, hands on 10 and 2 and I'm heading towards a four-way stop sign. That means every vehicle that comes here must they have to stop. All right, so I'm gonna stop right now. That car came before me, that is why she's going, the white car, and I'm now moving after that car's gone. When you are, when you are at a four-way stop sign, the first car that comes there first gets to go. 
heading towards another four-way stop sign. And I have to stop. Count one and two. Don't do a rolling stop, do a complete stop. Then I can start going. Heading towards another stop sign. Always do a complete stop doing your stop sign. I'm going right, I see you now right. Check my mirror and check my side to the right. And I'll come to a complete stop here. Check what the road looks like. It's good. And there we go. Now that's a 50 maximum. take a look in front of you always look at the maximum limit that's 30 so that's 30 don't go above 30 here if you do examiner is going to fail you so I drop my car to 30 heading towards a stop sign signal left check my mirror check my side and I do a complete stop and there we go taking the left turn Yeah, Pia is a beautiful town, beautiful city. You should come check it out someday. So I'm heading again towards another stop sign. I'm going right, so I signal right, check my mirror, check my side to the right. I'll do a complete stop. Always do a complete stop when you get to a stop sign. No car is coming from my left. Now I can hit the road and start going. The road signs everywhere is pretty much easy. Pretty much easy. Another stop sign ahead coming. Now I'm going left, signal left, check my mirror, check side to the left, and I'll do a complete stop again at this stop sign. There we go. I'm going to creep forward a little bit to see what the road looks like after I've done the complete stop. My right is not yet good, so I'm waiting for cars to clear up. Okay, I can go right now. And there we go. Beautiful. I'm doing a right turn here. Signal right. Check mirror, check side. No stop sign. I'll just move into the right zone. That's it. And we have a maximum 40 ahead. So I'm doing 40 right now. Don't go above 40. If you do, gonna get marked or fail all right so guess you can see that the, the road rules and traffic sign everything is just basically the same that is what you have to just uh, kind of get used to what the traffic rules looks like everywhere okay so I'm heading towards another thing that looks like a stop sign ahead of me and I'm going right I signal right and I'm going to do a complete stop at this stop sign not a rolling stop that's it i've done it the road looks good now i'm taking my right turn anytime you signal always check your mirror and check your side to the right or to the left anywhere you signal so i'm heading back to where we came from i have a huge sign ahead of me and i'm going right i signal right if a car is coming i have to yield for the car it looks like a car is coming okay all right not for now so I yield it, but no car is coming, so I have to go. And I'm going back to where we came from. Signal right. We are back to PEI access PEI. Back to the office driveway where we started from. All right. So that's a quick drive 
around the access road of PEI. So in case you're gonna do your road test in PEI, you probably want to watch this video and look at what the road looks like. Just look at those signs. We have the stop signs, we have four-way stop signs, we have just one-way stop signs. At some point, we had a three-way stop sign and we have traffic light. We just follow the rules of the traffic light. We had um, 50 maximum speed, we had 40 and we had 30 at different spots. Follow everything strictly during your road test and you should be good during your road test. Your hand should be on 10 and 2 everywhere at any time. Anytime you signal right, check your mirror to that right, check your side, that is shoulder check to that right before you negotiate the, the road. That's the rule of um, traffic drive, I mean road drive when you're in um, Canada as a whole. So, all right guys, I hope that this video helps you and whenever you are doing your road test in PI, I hope you pass it in one go. All right, take care.